What's going on? You already know what I'm, it is. I'm, I'm actually sitting in my backyard looking at this beautiful super full moon. This is, if I'm not mistaken, this is the last super moon in of the year. Super moons, for those who don't know, is when the moon is at its fullest and it's closer to the earth than just your average full moon. So this is called the full harvest moon. And it also is uh, marking the fourth and final super moon of 2023. So yes, you are right. This is the last one. So with us, uh, with full moons in general, for uh, all my people who aren't into like spirituality or occultism uh basically full uh new moons are when you invite energy or you start a new cycle and full moons are when you are ending a cycle and you're getting rid of energy so you know the themes in our lives is after five the podcast uh we've been going through a lot of uh, releasing of energies uh, in our personal lives in our business lives so uh we wanted to talk a little bit about manifestation today in the podcast and also introduce our first episode officially of our series. Um, there's not a name for it. I mean, it's just under after five. But uh, as you all know, who watch the show, we are coaches and we've been coaching um, people across many different fields for years. I, I could say. I've been coaching since I was a kid for the most part, but I've been doing it as a career the past two years. So, uh, Ali, you know, give them a little background on uh, how you've been helping people, too. Well, you know me, I was one of those people that didn't have any type of direction when I, I graduated. I had no damn idea what I wanted to do, but I knew I wanted to do something. So I tiddled around and I joined the Air Force. Uh, you know, I. I, it, it was funny because, and it's funny you should mention it, on this exact day, 1994, I began my career in the United States Air Force. I left for basic training, and did that, that this was the start of my adult life today on this full harvest moon. Yo, that's uh, trippy. I, this <laughs> that's was, you know, this, this, day, this day is very significant. It, it's like a new beginning, and I'm going to back up and come back to your question, but I, I wanted to get that out there before I get to why I'm sitting out here looking at this full harvest moon. Because like I said, 1994, on this day, I began my career in the Air Force, and I remember sitting on that bus, and I didn't know what my life was going to be like. I remember my granddad looking at me and saying, you're going you to leave a boy and come back a man. And I had no idea what life would be like for me i just knew like okay this is a journey of my life you know i i, I wish to have and all the things that i wish to become and wish to have but had no idea how life would go for me and so far you know i'm happy with the results i had no idea on that day that you know things that has transpired would transpire today another thing was in what four years ago in 2018 on this very exact day well, let's back up a little bit in 2018 mm -hmm. i had took a position with uh in, in in jupiter florida i was living in outside of west palm beach for those that don't know west palm beach was and a company had, had took over and it was a merger and they decided that uh, they were going to close down a division of that company. And they came in on July, just came off of a cruise and said that, hey, we're laying off. And everybody in this building, this building will no longer exist. We're only keeping one in. Some of y'all going to get packages and some of y'all got to go. Basically, you're going to get laid. Basically, y'all, everybody going to be laid off if you don't find yeah. another job on the other set on this time. And it was this day that I found another position. I, actually, it came up in Facebook where they were going me a going away party on this day, celebrating me taking a position to move up to Tampa, Florida. Man. Yeah. And as you know, I always say this is really relevant because, you know, I got laid off during this time. Like what, uh, a couple of weeks ago, I got laid off. So I'm looking and I've been interviewing and everything which we'll get into later so mm -hmm. i'm expecting in this next week with this full harvest moon 
some different stuff because significant mm-hmm. things always happen during this time during period. This time period, yeah. You right though. Yeah. Like this a cold ass time period. It's a harvest, man. We we harvesting the the fruits of our labor through the whole year. Yeah. It's like I get laid off, and, and it's like it's you know I get laid off. It's either happen during this time or it happens mm-hmm. around the spring, March, April, February, March, April. It's usually these are the two time periods that I notice is like a pattern in my life that things happen. Yeah. 